With every release of the Service Provider console, Veeam has added more features and functionalities for which our providers can take advantage of, from things like self-service, onboarding, remote management, and ConnectWise integration. The Service Provider console is a one-stop shop for our cloud providers. Let's take a look and see some of the features in the Service Provider console. So let's take a look and see how the Veeam Service Provider console looks from a UI perspective if you're logging in as a top level service provider or bearing in mind, you could actually log in here as a reseller or a customer as well. If we log in as a Veeam Cloud and Service Provider at that top level, we'll have a holistic overview in terms of what can be seen. So we have client alarms, we have revenue, we can see the protected VMs here across all of our customers and companies, and then we can see other metrics that relate to cloud backups, replicas, and protected files. In the dashboard section, we get a new view that looks at all the jobs and gives us a really easy way to see what's happening in terms of success, failure, or warning. And what we can also do is filter between our resellers and our customers. So if we wanted to break this down and actually see what was happening in Aperture Labs, we can see this provides a much better view and we can see that this particular customer is a lot more healthy. When it comes to the actual company and how we configure that, if we go back to the top level view and click on companies, we can see all the companies that exist at this top level. So if we go in here and edit this particular customer, we'll see that apart from the basic information, here is where you configure cloud resources, backup resources, billing, bandwidth, new multi-factor authentication, and a bunch of other settings that pertain to this particular company. With regards to resellers, this is where we can come in here and create or modify existing resellers. For example, here we have a list of companies that Reseller One manages. If we wanted to add more, we'd basically go here, click on the new company that we wanted to add, and add it in. It's as simple as that. Overall, the UI of the Veeam Service Provider console offers a really great way to log in and get that first little overview of what's happening in the environment holistically. Having those dashboards that give you a great visual indicator as to what's happening across the environment and then in terms of company management and reseller management. Thanks for watching. For more, head to veeam.com.